everyone, it's Ma from Sparkly Belly. A caftan dress is a comfortable and feminine dress, perfect for summer, and it's also great as a cover up before and after dance performance. In this video, you'll see how to make this really easy caftan dress. So let's get started. To make this caftan dress, you need lightweight, flowy fabric. It can be light knit, chiffon, or anything that drapes nicely. You need about 3 meters of this. And your regular sewing tools. So first, stand in front of a mirror with your fabric. Fold the fabric like this, wrong size together, and see how long you want your dress to be. Hold the fold and lay the fabric on the floor and cut the excess fabric. Next, fold the fabric in half lengthwise and mark the corner, which is the center point on the fold. From there, measure and mark 15 centimeters or 6 inches on either side with pins and cut along the fold to connect the two points. I just made a straight neckline here, but if you want a round neckline, feel free to cut more. And at this point, try it on to make sure the head hole is large enough and take it to your sewing machine and finish all the raw edges by however way you like. I'm practicing using a hammer foot, so that's what I used. Back on the floor, fold it wrong size together again and measure about 40 centimeters or 16 inches from the fold and from the side edge and mark the point with a pin. From there, measure 40 centimeters or 16 inches down to the bottom and make a line. Do the same for the other side. Now all you need to do is sew down along the lines using a straight stitch and make buttonholes. Now the buttonholes are optional, but if you want to wear a belt or a tie around your waist area, mark the width of your belt at the top of the lines you just sewed and we'll make buttonholes there. For the buttonholes, you can make them without a special foot. Simply decide how big you want the hole to be and draw a line. Then go around it with a narrow zigzag stitch with the stitch length very close to zero and simply cut along the line without ripping the stitches. And if you want to make a tie, cut a long strip out of the leftover fabric. I used the whole width of the fabric and made it about 5 centimeters or 2 inches wide and sewed the two right sides together with a 5 millimeters or a quarter of an inch seam allowance. Turn the tube inside out and stitch the ends shut. And that's it! You can wear it over your costume with or without a belt or you can even wear it as a dress or a cover up over swimsuit this summer. Hope you liked it and if you make one, please share your creation on Sparkly Belly's Facebook page. And remember to sign up for the Sparkly Belly newsletter to get updates and free access to special patterns and resources only available to newsletter subscribers. Thanks for watching and keep sparkling!